strong ball there hopefully is going to be okay. And we're back to live action here, ladies and gentlemen. As uh, Todd mentioned, we'll try to update you on the condition of Chief Jay Strongbow later in this broadcast. Speaking of conditions, half man, half animal. Look at this. Look at this. Look at the size of this. I can show you on the Todestrator. Look at the size of this animal. 401 pounds. Mantar, managed Ooh. by the uh, irrepressible uh, king of the Smoky Mountains, James E. Cornett. Ben Jordan. I hope he's had his shots. Ooh. Well, I talked to Ben uh, before we went on the air. He's a little, he was a little apprehensive about meeting a man of this size. Look at the size of the thighs of uh, Mantar. Cornett uh, in his uh, P.T. Barnum attire. Oh, he comes oh, right at Ben Jordan. You're going to see a raw power display in this match, ladies and gentlemen. Mantar certainly has a great deal of potential, and it's going to be interesting to see how he progresses under the uh, tutelage of Jim Cornette. It's going to be interesting to see if Ben Jordan gets airsick the way he's getting thrown around in the ring. Tremendous power as a Mantar holding on to Ben Jordan here on the uh, action zone. Clubbing form right to the mid-back area. This is a man that has uh, outstanding agility and quickness for someone over 400 pounds. That low center of gravity. It's Ben Jordan trying to hit him with everything he can. He, he barely staggers this guy, Todd. Well, what half animal is he, upper or lower? I'm not sure. Oh, my! Oh. I know what half that was. That was a belly. The belly suplex. And Cornette says, get up, get oh, up. Oh, come on. You had the pin. Why prolong this? Well, Cornette wants to make a point with this man. Maybe this is just a message he's sending out to the other superstars here in the WWF. What an elbow right to the sternum. Is that his mating call? Jim Cornette says Mantar is half man, half beast, and he's all mine, and he can have it. Yeah, I wouldn't want him. Look at, this, look at this guy's feet. He must be like a 5E or something. Well, he weighs over 400 pounds. I don't know if those are his eyebrows that get all the way back or if that's his haircut. He certainly is awesome. There's no debating that. Well, he is, uh, has, a, as we mentioned, a, a lot of raw potential. Mantar manhandling. Here's a young opponent, Ben Jordan, back in the corner. We saw Mantar two weeks ago here on the action zone oh, take care of Aldo Montoya, and he's doing the same thing to Mr. Jordan here this afternoon. Nothing but a high impact, nothing but raw power. It's got to be over now, and it is. Look, at, is that a mating call? I'm not sure. I, I'm not going to respond to that. I don't know. Ugh, that's unbelievable. Let's take you back, folks. Let's show you a replay of Mantar in action here this afternoon on the zone against Ben Jordan. Watch this. Watch the awesome power of this individual. Wrenches his arm out of the socket, pulls him up, belly-to-belly -belly suplex down, and just the pin. This guy is extraordinary. Ladies and gentlemen, when we come back, we'll update you on the controversy between Bam Bam Bigelow and Lawrence Taylor.